I'm Butch Stearns. We're here talking about the 2012 NAB show about the great content shift with Steve Kaliski from Gen Arts. Uh, Steve, I want to talk about the shift in players, the people you end up working with, the, the different customers now, different types of customers you reach out. I want to get into it by with Gen Arts talking about your signature product, Sapphire. Mm -hmm. Talk specifically about what that product is. So Sapphire is a set of over 240 visual effects tools that's used by the most demanding broadcast video professionals and film filmmakers to create the visual effects that we see every day in commercials, films, um, music videos. And the hallmark of Sapphire is, is that it gives people extremely precise control over getting their work to look exactly the way they look at it and also saving them time in terms of that it's extremely quick to be able to do things that they would have otherwise have to have created it very manually or have had to have done in a 3D environment and allows them to work strictly within Sapphire and their native host application. So as we talk about the great content shift, we talk about the shift in players, the people you work with, the people you're targeting, Sapphire I'm sure has changed. You, I'm sure you've made it more user friendly for a different type of people to use, correct? Well, what we, so the Sapphire architecture is a, is a really flexible engine. What we saw was is that there was a need of a, of, a, of a different audience, whether they were doing marketing communications, educational institutions, event videography, who needed the same production values of what Sapphire had to offer and the same types of tools, but they were really, they were less focused on the technology. They weren't technologists, which was historically was the you know the higher end of the market but they still cared about making their content look good and so we introduced with our new product Sapphire Edge what we call a looks based workflow that it was less about the effect and it was really about the end result you were trying to right. achieve and so that allowed people to see the visual effects visually applied to their media and browse them just like you would look at a gallery of of images and say oh you know whether you or your, cl your client say that's exactly the look I'm trying to, to achieve you use that you choose that look and then you can still customize it so that it, it you can make you know whatever changes you make to it but it really allows the users that say I can't afford the time to spend I have a um, you know clients only has a fifteen hundred dollar budget I don't I can't afford to take the luxury of spending a week on this I have to turn this around in a day and this allows them to not compromise the end result, exceed their client's expectations, but do it in the most cost-effective way. Yet in, in the great content shift, in the need for content anytime, anywhere, if I'm reaching out to my clients, I still want to differentiate my production value from my competition. So there is the need for me to do it within my budget, to have the speed to do it, and that's sort of what you guys are doing to keep up in the industry. Exactly, and it's, and it's funny you should mention that because one of the things that what you hear from customers when, you know, when I contact them to see how they, how they like Edge and the Edge product, they go, don't tell, don't tell my competition about this because it is their competitive <laughs> Edge. It is, that's, you know, it's the secret sauce that you know, every chef has a silver bullet ingredient and this becomes their secret sauce in terms of that they use Sapphire Edge you know, you don't know the end user, your, your customer, the end viewer doesn't really know what they did, but wow, that looks really good. And that's what, you know, Sapphire and Sapphire Edge are all about. It's really about adding this level of sophistication to your content that it just makes it look better. He is Steve Kaliski from Gen Arts. I'm Butch Stearns of the Pulse Network. We're here talking about the 2012 NAB show and the great content shift.